Hey, this is Caleb with DSLRVideoShooter.com, and today I want to show you guys something uh, that is really, really handy and it's very affordable uh, and can save you a lot of money on lenses. What I have here is a Canon 50mm. This is the F1.4 uh, version. Um, this is kind of Canon's middle range 50. They have a cheaper one and then their more expensive F1.2. Um, I love this lens, beautiful lens, but one problem, or not really a problem, but uh, one thing that it doesn't do is really really close shots the minimum focus uh, distance I believe is about 15 inches for this lens um, and to get closer you're gonna have to move up to a macro lens um, but one thing uh, my sister actually found she's a photographer were these awesome little filter uh, close-up macro uh, filters that you can just attach directly onto your lens um, there's a, a brand that makes a pack of three and you can just stack them up like this right now I have three a, a two time one time and a four time all packed into one and uh, this just simply screws right onto the front of the lens like so um, exact same diameter so I can just put my cap right on the end of it and I have a macro lens um, I'm gonna show you guys some before and after so you can see the dramatic difference and the quality that these filters offer. Now, while it's great for just macro shots, one thing that's really neat is that you do have options to use different magnifications because there's three filters. Um, and as somebody who does a lot of more narrative film work, this is gonna be really nice because I don't have to have another macro lens. I can just set these filters on and get my extreme close-ups um, these are great for if you just want to do a pickup shot or you know a close-up of somebody's cell phone a computer screen if someone's typing something in a pair of keys text anything a book it's gonna work really well for text um, so that's just one tip for you guys is for this is the 58 millimeter version uh, for that filter diameter and the set of three comes with a little nice spiffy case was forty dollars um, these go all the way up to around a hundred dollars uh, just sub 100 for like a 77 millimeter uh, version so you can get them for for bigger lenses um, but I've been very impressed with the image quality that are coming off of these so hope you guys can check them out I'll put a link on dslrvideoshooter.com hope to see you there